In the world of movies, action, romance, thriller, we have compiled top 10 sci-fi movies which we think you did not know about. If you like this video hit the like button, subscribe, and share. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy as we go down on our list of top 10. Legacy. A Tron sequel 28 years later. The release of the original box office disappointment turned cult classic. For those of us who love the 3D light show and Jeff Bridges' The Dude Man, Big Lebowski, the studio's mistake was our profit. Looking back, it was a perfect movie to kick off the decade. Even though at the end of its first year. While not the first movie to feature the digital de-aging technique, May. The tech was at its infant. Nor are the first to classify as a legacy sequel, nor the first sci-fi movie to feature a sexy AI as a love interest, these kinds of movies increased conspicuously in the following years. Maybe in the next decade, we'll finally bring about a third Tron movie. Number 9. Prometheus. Do y'all remember that alarm? Holy smokes Batman. Ridley Scott's long-awaited continuation to his Alien franchise is not what most people saw coming, the soundtrack. Oh. The soundtrack. Maybe in the age of Dell, lifeless reboots, sequels, and live-action remakes audiences hoped for thematic recreation of the first or second Alien. Or maybe no one wanted an addition to the Alien franchise, who's to say? The CGI in this movie is outstanding. The actors played their part, I felt like I was a child watching Alien all over again but this time with better technology and sound effects zip through my screen. Numi Rapasa Shaw, Michael Fassbender as David, Charlize and Idris deliver a kick-ass performance in this low-radar sci-fi action pact. Number 8. Looper. Who does not love a good time travel movie? I tell you. Put back in the future trilogy and a bag of popcorn. I am in for the day. Yes. Even Time Cop, best JVD movie to date. Now. Looper. The sci-fi concept has become too common and is often utilized for comic blend plots. Whether it's for the whole plot, Hot Tub Time Machine, Men in Black 3, or just a significant plot point, yes. I am talking to you Marvel, Deadpool 2, Avengers, Endgame. Ryan Johnson's Looper is definitely a standout for beginning as a crime film involving time travel. Then temporarily becoming a buddy film. Pairing young and old versions of the same guy and finally turning into an action movie about protecting a super-powered kid. Number 7. Edge of Tomorrow. Tom Cruise has had quite a decade, mostly a success thanks to three Mission Impossible films. But also including a number of underrated and financially disappointing others. Starting with Night and Day and including his back-to-back -back sci fi efforts. Oblivion and Edge of Tomorrow. Edge of Tomorrow known as its tagline turned title, Live, Die, repeat. Based on the Hiroshi Sakurazaki novel All You Need Is Kill, Doug Lehman's Edge of Tomorrow is one of too many Groundhog Day style, movies this decade about a character stuck in a span of time. Edge of Tomorrow leans into the way the structure feels like a live video game. It's one of the funniest and most exciting sci-fi action movies thanks in part to Cruz's charm. In addition, great writing from the team of Jess and John Henry. This movie brings a full pack action live, die, repeat. Number 6. Interstellar. Who are we kidding? Hans Zimmer and Christopher Nolson. Soundtrack and directing genius at the Tron. Interstellar can be heavy-handed. And predictable and strange and overly memeable but it sure is grand and immersive and mesmerizing and mind-bending and definitely beautiful in both its visuals and its soundtrack. I especially appreciate the way it employs documentary footage in real science and plausibly fantastical production design in its space odyssey. Christopher went deep into critical thinking of what if? Matthew and Anne deliver outstanding performance. They travel through the stars. If you are a Star Trek fan and love unpredictability, this interstellar will not disappoint. Number 5. Blade Runner 2049. In this sequel to Ridley Scott's 1982 masterpiece Blade Runner, Villeneuve capitalizes on the style and aesthetic of the world Scott and original short writer, Philip K. Dick, envisioned. Through the lenses of Dickens, whose work catapults an otherwise still impressive film into the forefront with its constant flurry of perfect shots that warrant a pause rewind. Villeneuve was able to craft one of the few major studio follow-ups that isn't a creatively bankrupt cash grab, and cinema is better for it. Why it failed to draw the average viewer to the screen is a bit of a mystery, 
but there's no doubt time will treat Blade Runner 2049 well. The visual effect will get more appreciative as Blade Runner 2049 becomes a cult classic. Harrison Ford always steals the screen once he is in, and Ryan Gosling tried to reach the bar where Harrison Ford sat in the previous movie. Number 4. Arrival. Amy Adams, Jeremy Renner, and Forrest Whitaker star in a heady take on the aliens come to Earth premise. That undergirds sci-fi classics like Close Encounters of the Third Kind, The Day the Earth Stood Still. Another subtle time travel plot. However, I will not ruin this wonderful masterpiece for your enjoyment. Arrival outlined in mind-bending non-linear development. Focused on the complexity of communication across space and time and open to whatever potentially wonderful or terrible realities might arise as a result of the alien species landing. The story veers drastically from the other iterations. It's the kind of film you'll want to start from the beginning as soon as it ends. Tears streaming down your face. Mind racing with reinterpretations. Do you want to impress family and friends on a cozy Saturday? Arrival is for you. Number 3. Mad Max Fury Road. Not only is Mad Max, Fury Road the best feature to come out of the 2010s, but it's also the best example of what cinema was in the 2010s. Even though it's so exemplary that nothing has actually come close to its level of greatness. From its mind-blowing stunt work and its phenomenal production design. Mad Max, Fury Road also re-established writer-director George Miller as a master of action cinema 30 years since his last Mad Max installment. Rightfully earning him a Best Director nomination from the Academy which rarely recognizes that genre for that category. And it reminded us that John Seal is one of the industry's most underrated cinematographers, there's a reason why we post Fury Road still so much at the top three. Epic and gorgeous and spectacular and important and emotional and insane, this is quite a movie. Number 2. Inception. Hans Zimmer and Christopher Nolan are at it again. Nolan's mysterious follow-up to The Dark Knight would be another installment of his Batman series. The movie had cast enough actors from that franchise, and Leonardo DiCaprio was rumored a possible choice for the Riddler. Fortunately, Inception was really a diversion from the Dark Knight films and kept us assured of the filmmaker's imagination outside the limitations of DC comic book movies. Indeed, Inception is one of the more visionary movies of the decade, even if its originality of premise has been questioned to other films. Led by DiCaprio, Inception takes us down a rabbit hole into the matryoshka-like structure of astonishing set pieces within set pieces within set pieces as it follows a heist inside a multi-layered dreamscape. We put this as number two, because the story and vision and acting blend like a perfect course meal. This movie makes us think without being angry at what is going on throughout the scene. Number 1. Matrix. The movie that changed it all. Wow. What can I say about this movie? This movie changed the sci-fi era in films. Action packed outside the box filming. All movies in our current era looked up in The Matrix. The One. Keanu Reeves, Lawrence Fishburne, and Carrie Ann Moss. Directed by the Wachowskis. Action packed great visual effects. This movie is over 20 years old, and every time we need to see a great sci-fi movie. Are you ready to take the blue or red pill? Did you like our selection? All the movies on our list are located below. Help us funding our channel. Also, leave a comment and share our videos, and let us know what else you would like us to do a top 10 on. Thank you for watching.